Good morning. Today is Tuesday the 23rd of February and Jess Ranch just showed up at Corona Lake. We're going to put some fish in early this week because we've had a lot of customers come fishing over the weekend because of the lightning trout and the popularity. So we're going to load up the lakes a little heavy uh, this week to try to replenish the supply of fish or the population of fish in the water. And uh, then tomorrow the uh, truck from Chalk Mountain, Nebraska is going to show up and we'll load it up with fish. So we'll start here today and go over to Santa Ana River Lakes and put some fish in there also. There we go. Nice size fish. These are the ruby reds. We're sure getting a lot of compliments from our customers, and they really, really like them. They're great fighting fish, they're beautiful colors. They got real pink meat, delicious to eat. We're really happy to have them in the lake. A couple of good size ones there. Okay, now we're over at Chris's Pond and we're going to go ahead and release all the rest of these. I'm ready, go ahead. Alright, beautiful fish. Well, they're lively, aren't they? There it goes. I'm ready to go. Good size to them. Well, today's Wednesday afternoon about 4 o'clock and the big gigantic truck from Chalk Mound, Nebraska has finally showed up. They had a little difficulty getting here. But we're going to fill up Corona Lake and Santa Ana River Lakes with a bunch of fish. Here we are on top of the truck and we've got a whole bunch of fish going in. There we go. Size fish in there, huh? Oh, yeah. I thought they pretty good. That's a bunch of tail walkers there, guys. Good color. I know, beautiful color. If the sun was out, you could really see it. But they are pretty. Hey guys, there's only a few days left before our big fish competition ends on February 28th. Currently, it's a 21 pound fish by William Spalda from Wildemar that is on top of the leaderboard. Now, yesterday I got a call from Corona Lake and one of the managers there said, there's a guy fighting a huge fish and he's been fighting it for about 24 minutes and uh, the fish rolled on top of the water and he said the girth on the fish was just huge. They saw the fish and then it took off again. And you know down by the dam where that uh, old tree stump kind of sticks up out of the water? Well, the fish went around that and broke him off. So, too bad that might have been the, one of the big 30 pound fish because again, they said the girth on it was just huge. So, guys, you've only got a few days left. Go out and beat a 21 pounder and you'll win yourself the, the fishing trip of a lifetime up to the outbacks of Alaska at Walks Off Lodge. And again, if that fish is caught on an Eagle Claw bait or a tractant, Eagle Claw will chip in a thousand dollars towards the airfare. So good luck guys, there's only a few days left. There's one in Santa Ana River Lakes and there's one in Corona Lake. Either one of them will probably set a new state record. So good luck guys and get on out there this weekend. This Friday and Saturday night we're also having our 24 hour fishing special where you can come out at 5 p.m. and fish all night long all through the early morning and then the following day and you get a 15 fish limit. This also includes the family special so dad uh, you can bring mom and up to three kids 12 and under they can fish on your $60 entry fee 
So they're free, camping is free, and they can help you catch your 15 fish limit. So that's happening this weekend, come on out. That's both Friday and Saturday night. Now during 24 hour fishing, we also have our regular day and night fishing sessions. So just because it's 24 hour fishing doesn't mean that you're required to fish the 24 hour special. Our regular fishing sessions are still available. Hey, we're gonna be out at uh, Bass Pro Shop for their Spring Fishing Classic for three weekends in a row, beginning this weekend. Now we're gonna have a booth there next to the big aquarium, and we're also gonna be sponsoring the Kids Fish Out Pond. Santa Ana River Lakes and Corona Lake has purchased all the fish for the kids to catch, so come on out and say hi. We'll give you some uh, discount coupons and uh, tell you about all the promotions we've got coming out. Hey, we're now over at Santa Ana River Lake. Look at that guy go, man. He is going to get back up. Then the following week, the Big Fred Hall Show, the big fishing tackle show in Long Beach starts. And of course, we'll be there with all of the big fish on ice to display. We're even going to have a sturgeon that's over 100 pounds, if you can believe that. Great big, huge trout. We're going to have some brown trout, some lightning trout. And we'll give you information about the promotions that we have coming up in March. Really exciting, we're gonna be stocking some big brown trout, three to five pounders, some maybe even a little bit larger. And we're also stocking some catchable size sturgeon that you guys can actually catch and take home. Now, these sturgeon are fish that are raised specifically for gourmet restaurants, so they're excellent eating. And we've got all kinds of information on our website about how to clean sturgeon and, and how to properly prepare them and all kinds of great recipes. So again, come on out and see us at the Fred Hall Show and at Bass Pro Shops for their Spring Fishing Classic. Thanks again for watching one of our stocking videos. This was the Ruby Reds and Tail Walkers this week. We wanted to load the lake up so that there would be plenty of fish. You know, like we said earlier, there was a lot of fishing pressure over last weekend. So we wanted to make sure we got plenty of fish in for this weekend. They say that it might rain a little bit, but again, you know, fishing at our lakes, rain really isn't a problem because the banks are sandy and you can drive right up to the shore and, and fish right there. So come on out and have a great weekend. Thanks.